Um, I am excited today to have guest preacher Madonna Sanderson Posey. She's going to come up and we're going to talk for a few minutes about the ministries that she is involved in. Madonna has recently returned from a trip to South Africa. She created something called um, the Ubuntu Global Foundation. And she's been working with AIDS workers in South Africa and um, people in South Africa for quite a while now, about how many years? Since 2003. 2003. So tell me a little bit about your recent trip to South Africa and then also how this came to be, how, how you created the Global Foundation. All right, well, first of all, we want to say it's so great to be back here at Southminster Presbyterian Church. We had a chance to celebrate with you when Pastor Liz came to join you. Um, I just returned from South Africa. It was my fifth mission there. And one of my roles is really to be a bridge builder between here and there, connecting the people and the churches together for the healing of the nations. I was a student at McCormick Seminary and there was a guest preacher, a pastor who came from South Africa, and as he was preaching, I just felt this pull to want to know more. I, I'm from a small town in Missouri, never thought of traveling, and suddenly I found myself over in South Africa learning about what churches and communities were doing to assist children who lost their parents to HIV AIDS. At the end of the two week trip, they asked us to pray about how we wanted to partner. And some of the pastors who came along, their congregation was actually gonna support an orphanage. But when I prayed about it, I saw the many churches here in Chicagoland, all the different denominations, and really felt my call was to connect those communities with communities in South Africa. And so that's how Ubuntu Global Village Foundation came about. I want to encourage also, um, we know here that at South Minster, our mission team gives grants of $100. If you have an idea for a personal mission project, they will give that to you as seed money. Nita Brandon is a recipient of one of those. And one of the items you'll see in the bulletin is that she is collecting items for the homeless. She has created something based on the first ministry, and she takes those items, she takes them down and puts together kind of care kits for the homeless. She is uh, going to be having a garage sale that comes up, and the proceeds of that will go to help that ministry. So, you know, LaDonna also started with an idea. She just felt this call, she felt um, God was leading her, and you made it happen. So in many ways, it started out the same way our individual mission initiatives do here. We have some yeah, pictures of a uh, recent trip. And um, LaDonna, you're also started in something new. You're creating a new ministry in Chicago called The Gathering. So tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, so coming up actually next Sunday, Pentecost Sunday, uh, we will be gathering in the city at 5 o'clock uh, for The Gathering Chicago. Now, for a really long time, I felt this pull to gather people from across cultures, denominations, and communities to gather uh, together in prayer and service, whether that be locally or globally. Um, and finally, we we're actually doing it. So we'll be starting this Sunday. Um, we'll also be connected with the South Africa Mission in many different ways as we um, work together in service and prayer. Well, thank you so much for sharing this idea with you. All right, thank you.